blue. Taking on Joey McKenna in the red and blue. Here we go. Underway between McKenna and Bartlett. Both these guys had some crazy matches to get to this point. Bartlett needed a last second takedown against Matt Kalazic to win. McKenna got up 8-0 on Jaden Ironman and held on to win 10-8. His opponent from the Nittany Lion Wrestling Club and Titan Mercury Wrestling Club, Bo Bartlett. And this was the weight everyone's been talking about, 65 kilograms. So much talent. At this weight class, Joey McKenna, such a, a seasoned vet here. Three times he's been the runner-up to make the World or Olympic team. And he's your top seed here. As Bo Bartlett working from a front headlock, but it's really McKenna who's threatening with that elbow control. As it looked like Bo just kind of circled out of bounds, and he did. Gives up that step out. One point. For McKenna. Level change fake there. Palman at the face is Joy McKenna trying to create an opening. And they're going to hit Barlet for passivity. And you're going to see that a lot. If you're not controlling center like McKenna is. And Bartlett happy to concede some ground here. Good, good level changes and fakes there for McKenna. We'll see what he follows up. Another level change. And they're going to hit Bartlett again for passivity. He's going to go on the shot clock. See if Bartlett picks up. Yes, he does. Attack right away. Pretty single leg, kind of a double to single. Now he's upstanding. And if he can get that one point step out, he will stop the shot clock. And you can tell us, whoa, he trips it for that might be four. Four offers are confirmed by the judge. As he pokes a little smile as he walks back to center. Not only does he stop the shot clock, he adds four of his own. So a five point swing there for Bo Bartlett. Just had to go on the shot clock and then found his offense. And I think McKenna was just thinking about, oh, don't give up the step out now. McKenna on a wrap arm single leg. Whizzer by Bo Bartlett. Up to his feet, now back down to the mat is Bo Bartlett. McKenna slowly working into better finishing position. Bartlett would be probably happy to just give up the one here. And he goes out of bounds. They're gonna let McKenna work for the finish, but no, they go out for two the score. Seven seconds to go in the first period which really picked up the second half of this period. And that's it, 4-2 Bartlett, and that four-pointer is such an advantage when you are in these tight matches, because if a match comes down to criteria, it's an advantage right now for Bo Bartlett. And the real difference right now in this match is the finish. Both guys got to a standing single leg, one guy, Went feet to back with the finish. The other came up with just one. But if you're McKenna, still plenty of time and plenty of ability to narrow this gap and get the lead for your own as second period has now started. And there's a double from McKenna and good pressure on the front headlock from Bo Bartlett. Really kind of moving 
McKenna around, he bounced towards the zone. And get up, pick him up. Now what is gonna be the call? Like I said, grounded, grounded confirmed. McKenna taking some more ground, but oh, good job clearing out of that front headlock and look for an angle with Bartlett, but even better job by McKenna squaring up, but now he's once again on the edge. And they'll go back to center, 156 to go here in the second. And McKenna, push, pull, snap. Looking to create an opening and does. He's gonna get at least one here. One on the step out. Makes it four to three. Coach Slay wanted to caution him one on top of the step out point. Shot attempt again from Bo Bartlett. That same leg attack he was able to convert. Couldn't get in this time. Another shot from McKenna, and a great job this time. Bartlett able to hit a go behind. He's got him on the edge, he needs to put him down, and he's just gonna get one on that step out. So for McKenna, he has to get to six points. Five won't get it done, a two is not enough, because Bartlett has the four pointer. Remember, there's no ties in freestyle, no ties in Greco. Someone is always winning and losing after the first point is scored. Underhook left side, a good head position there. And now it's gonna be another one at least. And there's a step out for McKenna, makes it 5-4, he needs a takedown. Or some combination of two points. 30 seconds to go. Do we see Bartlett try to put a finishing touch on this match as he just trying to hang on this final 20 as McKenna ends up in a front headlock trying to circle out of it is Bo Bartlett he grounds himself McKenna snapping trying to find an angle steps in upper body towards the zone now maybe trying to float over nothing as they're going to go off the mat out of bounds and Bartlett circles in 5-5 five, five. Bartlett has criteria he's leading McKenna's going to need one more point Four seconds to go. The clock is running out for Joy McKenna. Steps an inside trip, and that's going to do it. Bo Bartlett into the finals over Joy McKenna. The four-pointer, the difference.